How's it going guys? Kellen here at McLaughlin's RV and Marine. Today we're going to be taking a look at our 2023 Mastercraft X-Star S. This is going to be the baddest boat in their surf boat lineup, coming in at 23 feet, 5,800 pounds, and jam-packed with 4,500 pounds of ballast. This thing's going to be an absolute beast on the water. It is jam-packed loaded, and we are going to take a look at it today. As far as on the back of this boat here, we have our rear transom seating. So if you want to pull up to the sandbar, have a nice day and relax, you can lay out here. We have our leg rests that fold in, as well as our back rests that lift up. You get a cup holder on each side here in the center. On the back of this boat, we have our transom audio controls right here. So you can skip the song, turn up the music, anything you like to do, you got it right beside you. Down below here, we have our fold down step for getting in and out of the water. It makes it super easy and a nice little new feature to 2023 here. We have additional cup holders on the platform built in. And yeah, this is the back of the X-Star S. Let's jump inside. Hopping in the X-Star S here, we're gonna come through our transom walk through here. So you aren't gonna be damaging your seats while constantly walking back and forth. Underneath this transom walk through, there is storage for life jackets right above your engine. So it keeps them nice and warm. Otherwise, you can put ropes in there, whatever you'd like. And then as far as an engine on here, it does have their 6.2 liter supercharged engine. So that is top of the line, gonna give you the most power and torque to get this boat out of the water. Hopping on the interior of this boat, this one is outfitted with a nice tan and gray and black combo. Uh, this is their cool feel vinyl, so it's gonna stay nice and cool on those hot days. You aren't gonna be burning your skin. This center seat here, actually flips back for a rear facing. Let me show you how to do it here. All it is is a pull there, and boom, you can watch what's going on behind the boat, and they give you four more cup holders down below. But if you want it traditional, lift it up, and boom, there you go. But again, back to the inside here. On both sides, we have two clips audio speakers on this side, and then another one across from us here interior lighting throughout this whole entire boat and you can change the color so whatever you're feeling that day your favorite color throw it on we have three cup holders as well as some phone storage up top here on this side as well as usbs and same thing goes over there three more on that side uh, so you got a place to put your drink we have heaters recessed here on the bottom and those will pull out for those chillier days on the water as far as tower goes on this boat uh, this does have their Z10 tower, so this will be fully electric, up and down lowering. You get some nice color accents here that set your boat apart from other ones on the water. Our blackout clamping board racks here on a swivel, and then as far as clamping it, super easy. Can't be having those bungee racks anymore. We'll slide that back. Up top on the tower here, we have four Clips audio speakers with lighting as well. So out on the water, this boat is gonna turn a lot of heads and probably before they see you, they're gonna hear you. Now hopping over to our driver's console here. On the driver's side, we have our upgraded windshield here. So it is shortened. So if you're talking to a person in the water over the side, it makes it super easy to do so. We have our dual screens here with our rear facing camera set up right now. And then on your right, we have our huge screen that will control our Surf Star Surf system up top. We have our drive, surf, wake, ski, and chill options there. And you can fine tune it to your own needs. Down below, we can access things like our audio, uh, sound system, different lighting options that can all be done on that screen there. We have manual switches on the right side as well if that's something you wanna opt for. And a wireless charger down to the right for the driver. With this thing being optioned out, we do have a rear thruster here on top of your throttle. So all it is is actually a twist of this top knob here and you can shift the whole back of the boat left and right for easy docking. This one has our premium audio option as well. So this has two speakers on the top of both sides here uh, so you can get the tunes really going in this thing. On our passenger side here, we have our glove box so you can keep all your important information in there. A little storage compartment on this right side here, uh, another spot for a phone to get out of the way. 
And then of course our pass through storage here, super easy lift up and you have access to this compartment down here, a garbage can in there to get garbage out of the way, but you can fit a ton of boards inside there, life jackets, uh, whatever you'd like. This thing does not have a shortage of storage. Before we head up to the bow, I do quick want to touch on this compartment over here. We have a cooler underneath, super nice, so you don't have to have a cooler in the center where everyone's going to be moving around on this boat. Uh, they give you one underneath the seat here as well. Now we'll head up to the bow of this boat here. On the X-Star S, uh, the, the bow is your traditional, you know, your pickle fork, the signature Mastercraft pickle fork. We have two cup holders on each side here, as well as our clips audio and USBs for charging capabilities and a ton of interior lighting. It continues up here. We got McLaughlin green going right now. These seats in the front also do have flip down armrests for comfortability. One of those things that's just nice to have, keep you locked into your seat while the boat's moving and plenty of memories to be made out on the lake on this thing. If you guys would like to hop in this X-Star S for yourself, come into our Fargo showroom. We'd love to have a look at it with you.